Hi there, I'm going to play Coffee Roaster. Um, this is a solo game and I've chosen here, <clears throat> this is a medium difficulty and this one particular roast is called Zambia Kasama AA and the goal is to achieve 16, 16 roast level in order to get those 10 bonus points um, and uh, in there I have to pull um, some of these pre-filled um, chits I guess uh, some have zero points some have zero rows to level some are uh, green bean green beans some water um, these are hard beans and these are flavor tokens and um, the roast level is going to continue to increase which with every uh, round I can stop at any time when I decide that I think I've achieved the the best roast level and I am going to be able to pull out a total of 16 roast level here so all the numbered ones right now we're starting with 13 zeros and throughout the game those will increase I will be switching up the zeros as they pu get pulled out of the bag either by one one up or if they land on this if I'm on this section or this section it will increase by two roast levels um, so I will also have to pull out uh, from the bag at the end two blue flavor tokens and one green one in order to meet uh, all the requirements here so 16 roast level plus the three flavor tokens specifically to blue and a green in order to um, actually this is a beginner level sorry I was looking at this I thought it was a medium this is beginner um, let's see how it goes so to begin with I start at the one water level which I have on the card here a one and that's where you start um, roast at and I am going to pull out nine chits out of the bag and uh, you'll see how it goes. So let me see if I can make some room here to show what I'm doing down here. Now, I can also, I guess you can say purchase. I don't know if that's the right word. Put certain required colors, chits here, in order to get one of these special uh, bonus chits to help in the process of getting just the right um, flavored tokens I'll show. It's easier to just play it than to explain. But I'm going to pull out nine chits now. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Okay. So with these, I've got three zero roast. I've got some flavor tokens. I've got a water. And I've got a green, uh, a green bean. So what I want to do is increase the roast level by one. So I'm going to take these three. Z oh, I can't. I'm off camera. Sorry. I'm going to take these three zeros. So there's my flavor tokens. There's my three zero beans. Some a wa one water and one green uh, bean. So what I want to do is switch these three zero beans to roast up one level to three ones. So I'm going to switch them up for three ones. Okay, so I'm going to put them over to the side here. Those have been done already. Now this green, um, I think it's like a green bean, if I'm not saying that correctly. I, I'd have to look at the manual and I really don't want to do that right now. So one green bean, I'm going to switch that up to a zero and it tells you right on here, you switch it to a zero. So it goes up one level and I'll keep that. The water we want to discard. We can discard water and it's almost like the steam. It's uh, gone up in steam. The flavor tokens now, um, 
I know that there are three blue and two green and two red. Now I need two blue and one green for the final roast, uh, final cup uh, uh, trial. So I don't want to use my blues. I could use one green. I may have to. I do want to get this extra uh, plate, I guess you can call it. If it goes down here, then I can use this when drawing at the end of the, when I'm doing the test, the cup test, I can put some unwanted chits that I might draw over in here if I have this purchased, so to speak. So I'm going to use one for the green here. Now there are other things I can do here too, but I think I'm going to stick with that. I want that. I want to get that. So I need a red now to come out. I will also like a red for this wild card. Wild, uh, any one red, green, or blue. So I can discard, this little garbage can, I can discard the unwanted burnt, burnt beans, smoke beans, uh, any of those uh, would go. Hard beans, they would all go into the garbage. Only if I have this power um, activated. So I'll wait. I'm not going to use my green one. I want to hold on to that. So these all go back into the bag. So these all go back in. Give it a give it a good mix. So now my roast level goes up to two. Here is what happens. It says I need to put in some smoke into my mix here, and. That's one. I'm going to put one burnt, I guess it's like a burnt, a smoke actually, sorry, smoke. So I'm going to put that in the bag. That's in the bag now. Also, this two represents whatever I pull out of the bag is going to go up, not one level, one roast level, but two roast levels now while it's sitting in that position. So I'm going to pull out 10 chits. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. That's great. Okay, so I already see some promise in this. So I'm going to start with that red that I wanted. Um, and instead of putting it over here, I'm going to take my chances and wait that I'm going to draw another red one. What I really want to do is take this wild uh, spot and activate it here so I can start trashing some unwanted beans and smoke right away because I don't want those to get back into the bag. They're going to disrupt my pool at the end when I do the cup test. It's going to disrupt things if I still have a lot of unwanted um, hard beans or burnt beans or smoke in there. So I'm going to get rid of those. So those are the only ones I could really get rid of. So I'm going to get rid of this. This gets discarded, the smoke. And the hard bean gets discarded as well. Now the others, I'm going to put these blue back into the bag. I want to keep those. This green bean gets goes up by two levels. So now it doesn't become a zero, it becomes a, a one. So zero, one. That's two levels up. So I take one. Now you can keep track of how many levels you go up on the uh, roasting. I'm not going to bother this time. You don't have to use this. Uh, it's not mandatory. It's just for your own uh, counting. So now the next one is the two ones. They go up two levels, so not they go to two, three. So two threes is what I want to switch them for. So I've got two threes. Those go back in the those go in the bag. Now these zeros, the two zero beans go up one, two. So I need two twos. I'm gonna switch them for. Oops, there we go. So there's the two twos. This is all going back in the bag. So now the next level, we're back to normal. We won't be drawing any smoke. We won't. We will only be going up one level when we pull out some of those, when we switch them up, some of the beans. And we're going to pull out 11 chits from the bag. Give them a good mix. Okay, let's see. I'm going to go. 
see, I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, perfect. Okay, so put that aside. So let's group these into similar like and kind here. Okay. Okay, so I'm not going to mess with my flavor tokens. I want them to go back in the bag. I do want a red one. I'm still waiting for that red one to come out. So we'll keep those aside. I'm going to take my two ones, a few zeros and a two. So I'll start with the two ones. I'm going to switch them up one level. So these two ones are going to become two twos. So they each go up one level. So these two twos are going to go in the bag. I'm going to take this one two and it's going to go up one level to a three. I'm going to switch it up to a three, trade it in. Now these five zeros are going to go up one level, so they're going to be five ones now. And five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so these are all going in the bag, back into the draw bag. And, okay, so now we're going to move up to the 12. And now I'm going to have to put two smoke uh, chits back into the bag. So smoke increases. Things are getting hot. The roast level is getting higher and so I'm gonna mix so now I'm gonna have to uh, increase everything by two um, whatever I pull out the roast level is gonna go up by two each one that I trade in so I'm gonna pull out 12 from the bag there's 12 so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten and 11, 12. Okay, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Yeah, okay. Uh, so I'm going to group these. I didn't get that red one that I've been waiting for. Hasn't come out yet. Oh, okay. So I'm going to get rid of my smoke. Remember, I have the trash can activated and the hard beans. Hard bean and smoke is gone. Now, the green and the blue flavored tokens, uh, flavored uh, chits, I want to keep those. They're going back in the bag as is. And, well, there isn't anything, you can't convert them into anything except you can use them to fill in these spaces. Uh, so, okay, so here we are. Now I've got to roast them two levels up. So these two zeros are going to go to two twos. One, two. This one is going to go up to a three. These two twos are going to go up to mm, fours. That's really high level roasting, but I think I'm going to stop after this. Two. So these twos are going to be three fours. So I'll just switch them up. So there's the fours. And this one three is actually going to be a burnt, a burnt uh, bean. So because if it goes up, the highest roast level is four, then after that it burns. So this is going to be a burnt bean. However, with this burnt bean, I've got the trash can and I'm going to leave it right back in the back into the box. Okay, so these go back into the bag. Now, I could ask myself now if I want to stop and begin the process of the cup. And I think I will. Uh, actually, no, I won't. I need to pull out. This is where it gets tricky. I do need that red to come out so I can get this extra um, plate so I can put unwanted um, unwanted chits here. And I know that I've got two smokes, two smoke uh, chits in the bag, which are not good. Uh, it just decreases my odds of getting good a good result in the end. So I'm going to go up one more, one more roast level. And I'm going to pull out 13 chits this round. 
think this will be my last round. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. Seven, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and eleven, twelve, thirteen. Okay, so I've got my thirteen to begin with, and I see the red that I've been waiting for, so I'm going to grab that right away and take this extra little uh, plate and put it over here. So now I'm going to take my hard beans. My green and blue flavored tokens are going to stay, are going to go back in the bag. These are going to be a problem, but I think I might be able to discard them. Okay, so my green bean goes up to a zero, so I'll keep that into the bag. This zero goes up to a one, roast level one. These three roast level ones go up to roast level twos, so three of them. One, two, three. Those go back in the bag. Oh, this two goes up to a roast level of three. Goes up by one as well. And these two threes go up to a roast level of two fours now instead. So there we go. Those go in the bag. Now these two fours are burnt. Uh, they go up one level, which is a burnt bean, two burnt beans. However, I do have that trash can feature and I will trash them. So now this is all going back in the bag and now I'm satisfied that I can try filling my cup test. I'm going to do that. Now to do this, I can only, I'll mix it all up, of course. Okay, and I could only pull one at a time from the bag. So without looking, I'm just going to pull one at a time. That's how you do your cup test. Mix it all up nice. And first one I've pulled is a one. We'll keep that. I'll put that in my cup. Next one is going to be a three. Yeah, we'll keep that. So now I've got three, four. And if you recall, I'm trying to get a roast level of 16. Right? 16 to get those 10 points. Anything else will, the score will go lower. Okay. So the next one, I'm going to pull one here, is going to be a green. Yep, we need one green flavor token. So we'll put that in there. Let's see what else we're going to pull. So just okay, a blue. Yeah, we need a blue. So far, so good. Let's see what else I'm going to pull. This is a one. Sure, why not? So now we're at five. Okay, let's pull another one. And oh, that's not good. So I can put this in the tray. There's two trays. Now I can discard ones that didn't work out so well. Let's see, what do we got? Uh, four, sure. Four, yeah. I could do eight, nine. So far I've got a nine. So it's not terrible. Zero. We'll discard that. Now let's see, 4, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, hmm, I could get two threes, uh, so I need a blue to go here, so I could potentially get, I need seven more, so a three, three, and a one would work, four, Five, six, seven, plus. We'll see. So let me keep going here. Pull another one out. That's a one. I think I'll keep it. Uh, yeah, I'll keep it. Hopefully this works out. A zero? No, I don't want that. Burn a smoke? Don't want that. A two? Now let me think about this. Four, five. Okay, 5 and 5, uh, 10, 12, 15, 16, I really need a 4 or two twos or a 3 and a 1. No, no, I need a, ooh, I'm cutting that close. I need a, ooh, I need a 4, I think. 
There's a blue, there's the other blue I needed. Now I'm gonna need, let me think about this, this is eight, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. I need a 16, so I need a four to make this work. I don't even know, I can't recall if there's a four in here. Oh, awesome. I, I did not look, I should have put that on camera. I did not look. That was just really lucky. So let's see what was left in the bag. What could I, could I have pulled instead of that four that I needed? So had I pulled anything else, I could have had another opportunity to pull a four. I could have, dis so anything else I could have discarded would have been one, two, one, two, three. I had three chances to, to discard three unwanted. And I could have pulled, no, that would have been it. Nothing else would have worked, just the four. Perfect, that ended up working out quite nice. Okay, so with that, how do I calculate this? So I take my, take my, take my scorecard here. Oops, and I am going to, I've played a few, quite a few games. I'm enjoying this one. So I have played this one before and I didn't do it very well. So if I can recall the roast points. So I've I've achieved the 16 roast level, which gives me a 10. So I get a 10. Now the flavor tokens, I have my three qualifying flavor tokens. So three gives me a six. I believe I'm doing that right. So I get a six. Um, and how many same chits do I have? So I've got one, two, three, three ones. Three ones gives me, wait, one, two, three only gives me one point. So I get a one and any any extras that are gonna subtract. Oh, I'm not showing this on camera, sorry. Any extra, so the three ones, it gives me one, one bonus point. The three flavor tokens, right here, one, two, three I had, it gives me six points. And this doesn't qualify, because it's this one that I'm trying to get. 16 flavor, uh, 16 roast level gives me 10 points, which I, I have marked on here, the 10. So now what's left is any errors, any extras. I didn't pull anything extra like smoke tokens or anything into the cup. So I got lucky there. So nothing here. So I've got 10, 6, 17 points. So I've got my 17 points. Okay, so that's pretty good. All right. So uh, that's one game, one playthrough of Coffee Roaster. I hope you enjoyed watching. I hope it was understandable. Um, I hope it was straightforward. Um, there's a lot of other powers you can use to activate. And uh, I believe some of these uh, different cards, it comes with a lot of different um, coffee roasts so you can play there's a bunch of beginner cards there's expert level here and i believe there's some intermediate yeah intermediate level in there too and they're all from uh, different parts of the world there's uh, brazil there's uh, burundi there's uh, india kenya all the different coffees of the world cuba panama costa rica it's really it's an awesome game i love this game i love playing a solo um well it is a solo game excuse me um i really enjoy it um i wish there were other games like it something like it an engine like this it doesn't have to be the same it's slight variants um it's a nice challenge it's fun it's light um yeah anyway so uh that's coffee roaster and thank you for watching